guys and welcome back to Conan Exiles um, back at the camp with my mute friend no brain yo dude I've noticed one thing I've noticed is it's a lot harder to sort of get levels and shit when you get to a certain stage there's someone out here or something? Someone out here or something? So I'm gonna sh basically show how to gather food. Um, now there's a number of sources for food. Um, let me just show you what we've got so far. So you've got grubs which you can pick up off the ground. I'll see if I can find one actually because there was actually some around here earlier. Um, you want to stay away from that thing. You've got grubs. There's nests which have eggs in normally but there's no in that one because that's already been looted. Um, I think there's a refresh on loot in terms of how long it stays there for. I'm pretty sure it doesn't stay like that. So I'm just going to chill this guy for a bit while we get set up. The seeds as well, which I'm guessing you can use to grow plants. Handful of insects, which you can get out of bushes. You can also eat them. Um, the main aim to the game is just to keep yourself sort of topped up. So I've got these eggs. So you can just eat them, which puts your hunger up not much, but a bit. Uh, and the other thing I think I'll find is there might be some eggs back over here now. I'm not too, like I said, I'm not sure what the reef spawn rate is, but yeah, look, look, there's another one here. So you literally just run up to the nest and grab it. But if you do get caught near the nest by that thing over there, it will go absolutely ape shit and try and kill you. Now I've noticed there's a bug with the physics in the water, like it doesn't always register, like it doesn't seem to load in, so you run up to the water, your game freezes, I thought it was going to do it then, it freezes and then takes like forever just to fucking load up the actual, fit, what's underneath the water and everything. So that, I think that's, it's probably more of a, it's an early access bug, so yeah, it's not really something that they can really fix right now. Just going to grab all these plant fibres. Um, and the other thing you can do is you can kill things, you can get meat and then cook it. If you don't cook it, then the chances are you are going to get food poison. Now if you go over here, there's actually this plant here, which gave me earlier some aloe leaves. Now I don't know if they used to heal you or what, or what they used for. I haven't really worked that out yet. Um, but yeah, you need wood to put in the fire as well, if you are going to cook anything. At the minute, I think I'm just trying to level my, my character up. Looks like this guy's making some ceilings on the uh, building. So, that's pretty good. I'm not too sure if you can knock down the... Um... Yeah. So, yeah, this is the fireplace. Um, this is a guide to crafting, basically. So, you put your you put your wood in there. Sorry, you put your wood in there, that shows you what the burn time is, and if you want to turn it on, then you can do it straight away. Otherwise, you've got things like insects, which I'm not too sure how much they... They're just like a little small boost. So, do you remember when we ate berries on Ark? That's pretty much sort of the level of hunger that you're getting here. Apart from this, I think it's a bit more than the Ark one, because obviously berries you could get shit out in one picking. Whereas the bugs are sort of... You scare the shit out of me doing that. But yeah, basically, you, it depends on how much um, you can gather. What the fuck is that thing doing over there? Oh, we're extending the house. Let me, uh, I'll get some levels and then I'll learn how to make walls and stuff.
Oh, he's made me a water pouch. It's pretty nice of him. Thank you. When I first met this guy, I thought, shit, is it an AI guy? I went up to him and saw he had a name. I thought he was going to kill me. But he's actually turned out pretty cool. Like, he's helped me out. Oh. I just realised I didn't even have my spawn point selected there. So if I died, I would have spawned. Fuck knows where. So I've turned nudity off as well for the purpose of the video. Because I don't really want dongers hanging out. Um, but yes, there is nudity in the game, and yes, it's pretty fucking, the physics are pretty impressive, let's just say that. I don't know how to level up, like, is it quicker to kill shit, or? Let's go fill our water pouch up. So the water pouch works like arc, I'm guessing. Um, oh, it's already got water in it. So how do we refill it? Oh, so you just stand in the water and it refills. Fair enough, that's easy enough. So it's kind of like arcing that way. One of the interesting things about this game is the fact you've got AI in the world as well. Um, now, the AI can actually be confusing. If you you can pretty much stand still and act like an AI as long as no one gets near you and they will actually think that you're fucking an AI. So this is shelter. So I'm guessing when it rains and that, this will provide shelter because it's got a roof above your head. So that's pretty impressive in itself. It's got a system in the game to work that out. Yeah. It has come along pretty nicely, although we haven't got a back wall, I don't think. I'm pretty sure that dude is trying to get a load of shit. Although I don't know where he's gone. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to go through the eating system. So first I think I'm going to go through the basics of the game with you. In a sort of, not, not a patronising way, but just to show sort of what you need to do and what you need to gather. Then I think I'll probably go f to show... Where did that guy actually go? That's what I'm saying, I don't actually know where he is. That fucking door as well. I probably heard it on the mic from the fucking door making that squeaking noise. Oh, he's there. How do you make twine? Oh. It's fine dude, I worked it out. Oh shit. Is there any, like, stuff that you can raid with currently? Like, do you just smash the door down to get in, or is there, like, explosives or something? Why do you not have a mic? You are so annoying. I don't get how people play games and like, not have a mic. Like, fair enough, he's probably playing on his own and thinking, oh, yeah, I'll just check out the game, but so frustrating. My hair is longer than yours. You notice how quickly the trees grow back? So yeah, that's just basically a quick look at sort of the food resources in the game early on. Now, I'd imagine you can also hunt things because I've seen a deer. So I'm guessing you can kill a deer and like get food off it. But for now, I, will, I hope you enjoyed the video. And next time, I'll probably look at doing some more sort of killing and leveling. Um, or might play it for a bit and sort of get onto an earlier stage where I'm more advanced into my character. 
I think that's probably going to be the best thing because I think once you've learnt the basics sort of drinking and eating and surviving, then you go sort of more into getting gear and preparing yourself. But thank you for watching, guys, and make sure to see you next time.